a man treats you, it's exactly how he feels about you. And if you are thinking how your man treats you, if he loves you or not, trust me, you already have the answer. If you are doubting his love for you because of how he treats you so irrational, then know that he doesn't even care about you in the first place. If you are new to my channel, this is Bella. It's always a pleasure having you around. So in today's video, we will be talking about a very, very sensitive topic. And it's going to be how a man treats you is exactly how he feels about you. Listen, ladies, beautiful and amazing people. If you are in a relationship and this guy that, you know, you're talking with or if you're married or maybe you're engaged or whatever, if your partner doesn't treat you right, then know that that is exactly how he feels about you. If he is so into you, maybe always communicating with you or, you know, doing some amazing things to you and for you. If he does these things, maybe he cares about you, but if he is not doing it, or if you have this, you know, question running through your mind that, does this guy like me? Please listen, I'm going to share with you three tips. Three things, if a man treats you this way, you should put a question mark on there and then leave because he probably is not into you. So the very first thing is communication. If your partner, you know, doesn't give you full communication, if he doesn't communicate with you and give you full attention, then he doesn't care about you. If you are in a relationship, your man should always be there with you, for you, maybe texting you, checking up on you. You shouldn't say, oh, I'm sick or I'm not feeling so good and he never checks on you. It's been a month, two months, and you guys are not communicating. That means that he thinks or he treats you like an option, not a priority. Do not be with somebody that treats you like an option. You are a priority, ladies. You are the first. You are amazing. So you should be treated as one. So if he's not communicating with you, if he's not committed to you, you better run. Yeah, you heard me run. That is not who you should be with. Or if you are with him and he's texting, maybe all the time he's on his phone, he doesn't check on you. If you maybe you guys are trying to spend quality time, he's always trying to do some other thing that pleases him. Listen, I'm not saying that your partner should not do what makes him happy. No. What I'm saying is it's like a continuous thing. He is always on his phone, always texting other people out there instead of being with you, never communicating with you, you know, always treating you like an option. The time that you guys have to spend quality time, that's when he's trying to talk to some people out there. It's different if, you know, that's his business maybe because he's talking maybe to make some money. He just does that all the time. He is not treating you as a priority. He's treating you as an option. And if you are with somebody like that, you better move on. If you are being with somebody who is not committed to you, you better move on. If you are with somebody, you know, when you are with them and he introduces you to his friends, like, um, this is just a friend, you know, whatever, yada, yada, yada. You shouldn't be with that person because they are not proud of you. Be with somebody that is proud of you and if he is proud of you, introduces you to his friends and family like, oh, this is the lady I'm with or this is my world. You know, everybody has their own kind of love language and stuff like that. If he is not doing these things, maybe you guys go somewhere, you know, he opens the door to, for you. He respects you. Ladies, that is a man to keep. But if he is not doing these things, he is not the right man for you and he is not treating you right so if he is not treating you right then beautiful people that is not the man for you so that is what he thinks about you if he is treating you with so much disrespect you know that's what he thinks about you and it's time for you to leave like i said in one of my videos it's high time you read the red flags look out for the red flags 
and move on because a lot of us ladies you know we always date people you know not because they are, they treat us right but because of potential and that shouldn't be the fact do not be with somebody because of their potential or maybe tomorrow you know he may treat me right he may change you know he may be this he may be that what if he is never what you think he would be or he should be what if he never changes what if the potential that you have in your mind he never gets to achieve that what if so ladies be with somebody not because of their potential be with them because of the face value that they have for you or rather be with them because of how they treat you look at the face value of things that they present to you if they present to you love joy happiness and all of that then that is what they think about you ladies i want you to know that how a man treats you it's how he treats himself if a man treats you bad that is how he treats himself. And definitely, if he can treat himself like that, that is who he is. He will never change. And ladies, move on. And know that if you even have to ask that question of, is he treating me right? Or am I in the right relationship? You already got an answer. Move on. You can be a better version of yourself. If you look at this red flag, because if you are in a toxic relationship, it will cost you your life, your vision. If a man doesn't treat you right, if he doesn't take care of you, if he doesn't respect you, if he doesn't appreciate you, you know, do little things that, you know, make you feel like you are a queen, that you are, that is not the right man for you. You should be able, you know, to encourage you motivate you to go or pursue your dreams not suffering from insecurities you know because when he is insecure irrespective of what you do it will never be good enough for him ladies how a man treats you is exactly who or what he thinks you are and for you to prevent being in a toxic relationship you should watch out for this signs and move on dump them in the trash because you always deserve better until next time this is bella it's always a pleasure having you around